Prince Andrew very obviously on the outside despite Christmas family tradition. Prince André may have been on the Sandringham Royal walkabout but it doesn't mean the disgraced royal is on his way back to the firm's front line, an expert says. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. Prince Andrew looked relaxed as he circulated with Christmas well wishes at Sandringham. But this does not mean he's back on his way into the royal fold, according to one royal expert. In fact Angela Levin, royal commentator and biographer, thinks the disgraced prince is still very much on the outside when she discussed the festive goings-on at the palace on Sky News Australia. She said he's very much on the outside but King Charles has made an obvious decision that there is a family relationship with him. She added, he's not allowed to do anything. He's not allowed to go to any engagements, he can't be called HRH. But he is a member of the family and Fergie, as she's known as, she, it was the first time in 32 years that she joined the family for Christmas. Ms. Levin went on to talk about how meanwhile Andrew's ex-wife Sarah Ferguson was making her way back into the inner royal sanctum, as Queen Camilla doesn't hold grudges. She felt it was about time she was drawn back into the family. There has been plenty of speculation as to why the Duchess of York's invite was put forward by King Charles. One commentator believes it was because of the king's fondness for Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie. Robert Hardman, author of Charles III, New King. New Court. The inside story, told the BBC the monarch wanted to show his affection for the Duke and Duchess of York's daughters. Asked what should be read into the Duchess's appearance at Sandringham, he said, life moves on. I think it's a sort of readjustment. You had the king in his, Christmas Day, speech talking about compassion. Fergie was out in the cold, if you like, really ever since the breakdown of her marriage back in the mid-90s. And there she was yesterday. The Daily Mail's Richard Kay says the reason behind the invite was her loyalty to Andrew. He said, for the answer, one needs to look no further than the man who was striding alongside her in that church-going group on Monday, her ex-husband, and devoted companion Andrew, the Duke of York. In the four years since Andrew's fall from grace, no one has been more supportive than the former publishing company Girl Friday with whom he fell in love as they fed each other profiteroles at a Royal Ascot House party almost 40 years ago.